Hi, it's Lindsay here. I am about to start a challenge today. Uh, Allie Brown, I'll link her below. Uh, she did a challenge over the last week or so about um, supplies and she called it Honey's Slim Pickens. And what it is, is you have a loved one um, pick out five supplies for you to use on your journal pages. So, I am going to be doing this next set of pages. I don't know what stuff I'm going to be using. I might do um, some dance stuff or whatever, but anyways, that doesn't really matter. What matters is, is that I use the five supplies that my husband picked. So, I'm going to flip this over and let him pick his five supplies. And then I'm going to flip the camera back over to, um, to do the actual journaling. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll probably take my book out just because I don't want to get the rest of my book um, wrecked or whatever. But, but anyways, so I'll let you watch as my husband picks the supplies that he picked. And then we will do something with these pages. <laughs> Alright. Okay, so you just need to pick some five things from the table. Okay. And up on the shelves too, obviously, because there's markers and stuff up there. And you just put them here on the table, and then I will use them to create my um, next journal pages. <laughs> so I can pick like one one, one of the, one of the rolls. One of the rings or one of the rolls. One of the rolls. It's just like one piece of everything. Oh, okay. So like if I picked like this, it would just be one stamp. Or the whole stamp set? Um, I'm not sure. I guess you could just pick one out of it if you wanted that set. Okay. We'll pick this one. Okay. That up there. I'll go with this one. Okay. <laughs> It's just like one of those yeah. binder rings. It's a matter of finding the opening. <laughs> Go with that one. Okay. So that's three. But right, you said some pen up here. Yeah, there's markers up there, yeah. This one. <laughs> and well, I guess you need some ink to go with this. So with that I think piece? I can just use my Versa mark or something, like to go with it, just as a like that's one. Okay. This stuff too. Yep. I do need paper with it though too, so <laughs> if you use a, st a punch. Oh, you mean I need to like grab paper too? Well, you can if you want to, but like my journal pages are journal pages, so. Oh, okay. Those are inks. There we go. Okay. So you've picked a Tombow marker in red, a stamp, and then of course I put the stamp with it, some grass washi tape, 
the Distress Stain in Fossilized Amber and another stamp pad in Summer Fields and this is a chalk ink so we'll see <laughs> all right that wasn't that fun <laughs> um I actually didn't expect him to pick the stuff that he picked he kind of picked randomly which whatever I guess he's he's a very random person he likes to be random a lot about a lot of things he like when we go out for dinner he has a dice app on his phone for picking dinner and just yeah so anyways so we have a roll of grass washi we have summer field chalk ink <laughs> we have distress spray stain in fossilized amber we have the Tombow marker in color 847, which is like a deep red. And we have Versif the Versifying for the stamp. Um, just because I figured I could pick a stamp and a pad as one. So I just thought I would throw that one in there. It might be cheating, I'm not too sure, but... Um, I think that would work. I could also just take this out and just use the summer field as well, but I thought I would um, make this one so that I could, if I wanted to watercolor on this, that I could. Although he didn't pick, I guess I could use brushes because I need to spread the medium out somehow, right? So I pick one brush and, of course, some water. So I am going to turn on some music and get started. Okay, so there it is. <laughs> um, I actually kind of like it. It's really cute. It's kind of springy, even though it's snowing outside right now. Um, yeah, so I guess I think I used all the supplies. I used the marker, I used the green, I used the spray, and I used this, and I used the stamp. So yeah, uh, it didn't turn out as bad as I thought it was <laughs> going to. Um, I think I like the sort of rays of sun. I might be able to put like a title or something in that. Um, and then do some journaling and whatever, but it turned out really good, I think. And I'm not, um, because I didn't gesso these pages, the Tombow marker didn't react with the water the way that I wanted to, but I think it looks okay. Like, I don't think it... I don't think it looks totally, totally bad. It kind of looks caveman-ish, maybe. And, yeah, and then I guess 
that's pretty cool. I, they're not colors I would have picked normally together, but they do work well together, so that's really good. So I hope you enjoyed this challenge. Head on over to Ellie's blog or Ellie's page and uh, watch her videos. There's also um, links to everybody else in the challenges videos there as well. She has a whole playlist and yeah, maybe do your own because this was kind of fun. So I will see you in my next video. Bye.